Right, so good morning again, uh, Jeff Ginsburg, and I, um, I also was one of the founding members of the Genomic Medicine Working Group that uh, Terry and Rex uh, mentioned, and I just want to say that I'm, uh, to echo their comments, how uh, great it has been to be on this journey with all of you, um, and what a critical milestone I think it is to have a meeting on implementation science and genomic medicine in our journey. Um, I want to do two things before I start the session. The first is I want to um, thank uh, um, the, the, the people that have really made this meeting possible, which are Teji Rakoberis and Julia Walker from Duke University and Cecilia Tambro from the NHGRI. Um, you know, meeting like, meetings like this just don't uh, sort of spontaneously come together. It requires a lot of effort and coordination, so I, I just wanted to make sure that we recognize um, the people that have made it possible. The second thing I wanted to do is, um, is uh, actually do a little survey. So how many of you in the audience consider yourselves to be implementation scientists? Wow, that's more than I thought, but that's good. How many of you in the audience collaborate with implementation scientists? That's excellent. I, I would have guessed that um, if we had asked that question at the GM1 meeting, no one would have raised their hands. So I think that's really, uh, uh, again, a, a milestone in, in where we are with the, with the field, um, having people that are legitimate implementation scientists um, and also people that are working closely with them. So, um, and that is a great segue to bring our first uh, of the three speakers today, uh, David Chambers, who is the uh, Deputy Director of Implementation Science at the National Cancer Institute. I don't know how long that office has been in place, but I bet it wasn't in place in 2011. So David, welcome. 